Hey, welcome back to Fetch Quest, everybody. We have defeated, uh, what's her name? Maylene, I think her name was. I don't know. I can't remember. Uh, that also proves why I don't know much about Gen 4. Uh, May asked for our help. Uh, so we're gonna go do some double battles, I would assume. Oh, I have a, do I have a mystery gift? Uh, I'll, I'll do that later. I, I never see that come up before. That's interesting. Or maybe I just wasn't paying attention. Uh, let, let, let me I think now is probably a good time, uh, to level up some of our other, uh, guys. I think Aquaria should be able to run train on a lot of these. It's fine. Okay, so then, yeah, we're still gonna roll with Gyarados here. Uh, you're going to try to get the Pokedex back from us? Not when we, Team Galactic, can make so much better use of it. But okay, guarding the warehouse does get boring. We'll take our you on two on two. Hi, Jojo, can you please help me? I dropped my Pokedex by accident. Team Galactic found it now they won't give it back. Please, I need your help. Team up and bow with me. Fine. You and your Pokemon together with me and my Pokemon. Unite like this. Our dream team has no chance of losing. I'm not letting Team Galactic get away with this. God, she, she just talks so much. I, 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 I mean, I, like I said, I know it's it's the same with the guy's dialogue. Uh, I, I know it, it, it's the same dialogue regardless. This is too much dialogue. All right, so I just got a Clefairy. Nice. Uh, I would love to have a Clefairy, or really any Pokemon that's not a water type would also be great. Cause I, yeah, exactly, yeah. God, Dust Tox and Beautifly both collectively kind of suck. <laughs> All right, keep the levels going, keep the leveling up going. Good. Air Cutter, that's okay. That was a critical hit, even. God, it really can't do anything. <laughs> uh. Crow Gunk might have dry skin. Maybe. I'll, I'll go ahead and take out the Beautifly here first. I'm not too particularly worried about the Crow Gunk. I mean, it can obviously do that to the Clefairy, but that's not my Clefairy, so I don't really care about it that much. Uh, yeah, I'll take out. I'll take out. The, I'll go for the Skunky, and then we'll then we'll find out the answer to if Crow Gunk is. Uh, I'll probably just use a different move entirely. I don't want to know the answer necessarily. It's not going to help me later on to know the answer. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't care about it using anything on me. Uh, we'll, we'll use Crunch. Yeah, it should still be powerful enough to take it down. And it is, so we are good. Okay. Alright. I defeated the Team Galactic Grunts. I forgot how prevalent they are. Done in by two kids, this isn't right. I should have kept my head down and just watched the warehouse. We, we've had an interaction with them in every area to this point. Th that's, that's too much. I feel like there should be a break like every little bit. Aw, oh, that sucks. Our Pokemon are weak. We should get a new one from headquarters. <laughs> Who cares about some Pokedex anyway? Team Galactic is going to own all the Pokemon in the world. No, in the universe. There, take it! Take your Pokedex! Those things we had in the warehouse, we've already been moved to Pastoria City anyway. So we'll say, he'll get yours and run like the grunts we are. And that's kind of fun. What is going on? Why is Team Galactic out in the streets if they own the place? Jojo, thank you, seriously. If Professor Rowan ever finds out that I lost my Pokedex, ew, I don't even want to think about it. So, Jojo, what are you going to do now? I'm thinking of going to Pastoria City. The Great Marsh there is home to many kinds of Pokemon. Okay, bye. It's like she barely finishes a thought and she's on her way to the next thing. Was there anything in the warehouse here? They probably can't let me in. Yeah, I know. Oh, I fly. That's nice. Uh. I mean. Oh, I, I get it now in the Hidden Moves app. Okay. Well, it's good I did. Uh, what do you have to say? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What have we here? You are not so not Team Galactic, and you're a little kid to boot. The things we made with the energy we took from the Valley Windworks are already in Pastoria City. Huh? That's not what this is about? Rob, why, why are you texting me now, Rob? What? Oh, 
Right, for some reason, Rob texted me because he's in my backyard, and for no reason, because he's not supposed to come hang out with me today, and it's like, why are you in my backyard, dude? That's a weird thing to do. My backyard's also a highway, so, I mean, it's... He, he was commenting on something that he saw from the highway, and it's like, why are you... Why are you looking at my backyard, bro? That's so weird, and texting me you're looking at my backyard. So... Rob, shout out to Rob, uh, as for always leading me into a path of confusion. Get out of my way, nerd. Okay. The, the good news is because we were grinding, uh, we can just walk straight to the next uh, area, which is a gym. So you are getting a two-for-one gym special today where we get back-to-back -back gym episodes. Because for a while, just, God, the pace was just sucking. <laughs> the, 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 it just feels like the, the pacing's all over the map. Like... Like, gyms 1, 2, and 3 took forever to get to, and now we're going to have 4 and 5 in, like, quick succession here. It, it, it's it's kind of crazy, a little bit, anyway. Uh, but, I mean, I, I guess... I, I, guess, I guess it makes a certain modicum of sense that as you get more strong Pokemon, the game can also go faster, too. But it's not there weren't a whole lot of trainers in this route to begin with, anyway. So, like, I, I, just, I don't know what to make of it. Um, no, we just want to go this way here. Go, go top and around. Yeah, no, uh, I'm, I'm recording this on the Saturday the game came out, which I'm certain that this will air about two to three weeks, maybe afterwards. Unclear. I want to cut up some stuff, because there's a lot of me bullshitting. Um, we can, we can go the, is this, is this what I think it is? Great Marsh. Okay. Um, alright, so here's gonna be the rule, the first thing I catch, not encounter, because everything runs so quickly here. Uh, the first thing I decide to catch, that's gonna be the one I'm gonna add to my team. I feel that, that's the best way to do it, because, because Safari Zone is so random here. Yeah, I don't care about anything in the Great Marsh, it's mostly water types and a lot of, like, bad bird Pokemon. And uh, we don't need either of those. So, no, no, no Grade Marsh. No, we're not going to the Grade Marsh. <laughs> All right, okay. So, let me heal up. I don't really need to heal up, possibly. But uh, I'm curious to see how the leveling is going to go here because um, I, I should just be able to just plow through this gym with my, uh, with my Gyarados. Unless it knows, something does freeze dry, in which case... Well, I probably wouldn't have free drives. Okay, so gym time. Okay. Uh, actually, probably Roselli is probably uh, it's probably the better choice here. I mean, th this is why this is why I've gone through so much trouble to get Roselli is for uh, f is for a gym such as this. Oh, it's a uh, elevation thing. Okay. Yep, and I hit that, and goes down. Okay, so then hit this. Water goes up. Well, first let me let me battle the child. My body is the only thing I work on toughening up here. I also work on my Pokemon and my spirit. Good, good, good for you, kid. Good for you. Good for you. How are you working at a gym effectively? I, shouldn't there be child labor laws to prevent you from working in a gym? Uh, so I'm gonna assume it's probably as a float soul. Um. Oh, dude, am I? Oh, you know what? I'm wondering if it's because I accidentally took them out of the ball and they have the ability to. I hope that doesn't impact the run a lot. <laughs> I, I mean, I, I, it's too late to do anything about it now. Uh. I mean, my Roselia should curb stomp the, this group of things here, regardless. Uh, okay, so then if I get the water down, then I can go around. Yeah, that's the right play. Okay. Down around and go up. Can't do anything there. Green's gonna make it go. Uh, what are you fishing at, dude? Th there shouldn't be any fish in the water. If they are, they're all dead. Walter. Barboach. Okay, super dead. Uh, I think it's water ground. Uh, or, well, at least Wish Cash is. Uh, 
Yeah, Giga Drain. Oh, the only thing will be I'll just have to watch PP, but then I'll switch to Gyarados when I need to. Yeah. Uh, unless, unless I, do I want to use an Ether? I don't think I do want to use an Ether. Uh, when, when I switched over to, to, I mean, I should only really need like one or two. If I growth, probably even less. Pro probably even less. Th this should be my easiest gym. All right, traveled all over the globe while raising Pokemon. Ignore the Ponyta on the team, by the way. Uh, the Ponyta and also Goku will not be involved in this fight. If they were involved in this fight, I've done something wrong. Wingle. <clears throat> okay, so that that's I guess is the only ones I would need to watch out for is uh, why does it feel like the last game was had way more powerful Pokemon than this one? I, I just feel like the last game had two had just strong heavy hitters, but I guess I didn't have any special uh, attackers. Maybe that was maybe that was the problem because I was trying to hit them on the attack side. That's probably the issue. Just out of curiosity, how much will a stab waterfall if not very effective do? Murder is one shot. Oh, cap. The only thing I'll have to watch out for is water absorb. Uh, I also think... Because there's a, there's a man, man, man T uh, pre-evolution, too. So I wouldn't be surprised if Mantine shows up in this gym. I'm, I, usually, you can get an idea of what the gym leader is going to use um, based on what the uh, person was going to use. Oh, the last one throughout Lucario, and I've not seen a fucking Ryla this entire game, so what do I know? Um, for getting old move... Uh, yeah, I'm not making that mistake again. Um, now, granted, if I'm using the Ponyta on a serious level, I've, I've clearly fucked up because that means Goku has died. Uh... Ooh, okay, that, that's all the way up, but that's okay, that's okay. Um, back around. I want to become a strong trainer like Crash or Wake! Very interesting. I mean, I guess we can't tell children who their, who their role model should be. If she wants to have her role model be a uh, old man in a Speedo, then that's her business. I guess there's nothing... I, I, yeah, I, yeah. Um. Well, it, it, oh, it's a sap zipper. <laughs> That's the thing. Why is it not a norm? Why is it a normal type? Why is it not just simply a? Uh, wh why? Why is Asriel not a water type? Or it just it could just be a pure fairy type. It, it doesn't make any sense. That's normal. It, it just doesn't make any sense at all. <laughs> All right. Well, regardless, you're not water types. So you're definitely dead via waterfall. All right. Rob's clearly driving. He hasn't responded to my uh, to my text message, being like, "What the fuck, dude?" Uh. All right. Yeah. So waterfall. I mean, that's fine. I also had huge power. Huge power would put a dent in me pretty good. Huge power is a great ability. I'm actually a little bummed out I don't have a Meryl on the team, but uh, that's okay. Uh, my Gyarados is, is going to be better. Particularly if I can get to have Dragon Dance, which I don't know is a level up move. If it is, then I mean this. Then we're just going to steamroll for the rest of this here. Uh, Fisher Eric. Uh, send out a Goldeen. Goldeen is very shiny. I mean, I guess a lot of things are weirdly too shiny here. Yeah, I might have taken Pokemon out of the balls, and that's why they're kind of doing that thing. I, I, as long as they don't love me, love me, I think it's not going to impact anything. Uh, I'm assuming it's 4D. I don't want to use an ether though, that's the thing. Okay, well, he's dead. Because what I ideally want to do is I want to be able to stack a whole bunch of growths and then just one-shot everything. Uh, absolutely switch Pokemon. We'll go with my Gyarados. 
Insert the Spider-Man meme! Okay. Except mine's at a higher level. Although we're both lowering each other's attack. Uh, does he have crunch? I don't think he has got crunch. He might just have bite. He said scald? Why does he have scald? Oh, that sucks. Unless scald is what you get from this gym. It could be what you get from this gym. Um, what the literal hell is going on? What the literal hell is going on? Did, did I wander into... Did, did I wander into a competitive Pokemon match? What the literal hell? Why does it have substitute? It is it is sub and scald. I mean, I'm not saying that's a good competitive thing for Gyarados, but like, what the literal hell was going on there with that move set? Being number one in the world doesn't mean a thing. I I mean, this is true, but what the hell? <laughs> uh, okay, that that threw me for a loop there. Okay. <laughs> What, what a random thing to do. Uh, I do have a full heal in the event I get burned again, which is not a thing I thought would be a freaking thing to worry about. Because burn, burn, for those of you who don't know, did I not heal the burn? Oh, that's right, it doesn't refresh. That's so annoying. Why is it not auto refresh? Uh, just some of the design decisions, man. Let, let me tell you, I, I don't mean to be that mean about it, but I'm going to be. Okay, that accomplished nothing. That accomplished something. Okay, so I should be able to walk around and take these stairs up. Uh, I'm gonna leave Roselia with the amount of PP it has. Okay, there we go. I don't want to go back to the Pokemon Center at this point. Like the raging sea, I crash down and wash away everything before me. That's just how I roll! I guess Bill Nighy would have been a good one. That seems to come up in every playthrough of Bill, Bill Nighy for some reason. The, the reason is because he played, uh, I think it's the Flying Dutchman in, uh... He played the Flying Dutchman in the Pirates of the Caribbean movies, and he's got a very distinct speech pattern. Uh, which I think I've done in a video before. In any case, I don't... Some of that always feels like I go back to Pirates. I don't know why. Well, I mean, I know why, and that's because I'm writing a pirate character in a script I'm writing on. But that that's a different matter entirely. And also, my script is very dumb and stupid, so... Uh, eventually you guys will see what that is. I'm, I'm working on a game, uh, in my spare time, and I will eventually release it out to the world. Uh, and obviously if you want to know more about it, this game that I've told you nothing about other than I'm making it, well then stay tuned and maybe I will share some information with you at some point down the road. <laughs> uh, Shellos is a good Pokemon. I like Shellos. I like the blue one better than the pink one. I think that just comes down to personal preference. Uh, of course it confused me. Because we can't have nice things. Uh, it's because I bite on them. That's why. It, it, it's solely because I bite them that I can't have nice things. Sailor Samson. That wave didn't even wash my hands. The, the texture of the clothes is, is interesting, though. It feels like there's actually, like, textured stuff to the clothing. It's very weird. Uh, I, did I, not, I guess I didn't beat the, this guy here, either, so... I mean, I did. Oh, I did. I, I beat him already. Okay, well then, here we are. Um, we can use a berry. We can use an orange berry. We have enough berries for, for, good lord, we have enough berries. Okay, um, yeah. So let's go ahead and, uh... I'm gonna switch back to... Blossom. Okay, let's go. He seems like a guy. Welcome! I don't get challenged very often! The glory you are now beholding in the Pastoria Gym Leader! That's right, I'm Crasher Wake! My Pokemon were toughened up by stormy white waters. So they'll take everything you can throw at them and then pull you under. Victory be ours! Come on, let's get it done! 
I'm sending a vi uh, kind of a Drax the uh, Destroyer energy here. Uh, I'm, I'm sensing a little bit of a Dave Bautista vibe. Uh, I mean, his chest is perfect, if we're being honest. Uh, okay, well... So much for my plan of setup and sweep here. Uh, I mean, I can still do it. He's under... He, the other girl had like level 30 and I'm supposed to do her first. Why is this one different? The, the leveling is just all over the map. Ice Fang. Okay, that's... As long as it doesn't freeze, I don't care about that. Okay. We're gonna crunch too. That's fine. Uh, uh, that's fine. We're just two. We're just two snakes crunching on each other. We're we're, we're crunchy and munchy. We're gonna heal probably at the same time. Uh. I'm gonna use Moo Moo Milk though. Oh. I mean, that, that's that's okay. I don't care about that that much. I just want to keep up the health, because uh, we're probably going to need to use him as a switch in at some point. Okay. Uh, oh, I shouldn't have used Kylie in here. Kylie's not going to be helpful at all. Quagsire. Okay. Uh, That's not what I was expecting. Uh, I was not expecting Quagsire. But, uh, boy howdy, has there never been a better opportunity to set up? <laughs> Uh, don't, don't, don't worry, don't worry, uh, Rosalie, Rosalia, you're, you'll be fine, you're, 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 oh, that might suck, okay, oh, it's just speed, okay, uh, I, I thought for a second it was an accuracy drop, I, I don't care about that, as, as long as I can survive a hit, uh, from, uh, from, well, I presume his last Pokemon is Floatzel, then, then it's gonna be okay. <laughs> Uh, okay. I think that... I think that should be good. Okay. Giga Drain. Dead. Super dead. Uh, I kind of feel like I should abandon the, uh, the setup. Because... If, if it has any kind of strong move... Ah, eh, fuck it. We're, we'll, we'll, we'll roll with it. Hey there, that was a good move! Uh, I mean, it, it, as long as it doesn't get a hit in, it's dead. And it's under-leveled, and it's a water type. So, it has Ice Fang. Oh, that's so good. Okay. <laughs> that could have gone so south. <laughs> okay. that That is me breathing deep. <laughs> oh, goodness. Okay. Huh? It's gone and ended? How will I say this? I wanted more! I wanted to battle a lot more! Uh, okay. That, that, I actually feel like, you know that feeling of how, like, you know, when you feel like something's gonna be really bad and then it's not? So, why did I describe it that way, idiot? It seems the undertow pulled me under, but I had a great time battling with you. You've earned this! All right, so now we can go back, and now we can get the uh, the ghost uh, ghost leader uh, with her with her spooky Pokemon. You need the Fen Badge to use this hidden move to fog from your Poke Attack. There is a special reward for me in recognition of your team's power. I obtained the stickers that Wake uses, and also obtained TM55, which I assume is Scald, or it could be Ice Brine. Oh, okay. The the move you didn't bother to use. <laughs> inflicts double damage on targets with less than yeah it, it Brian's actually a, a pretty solid move uh, okay uh, yeah no th there's a there's a relief off my chest because I thought for sure Rosalia was gonna die and then she didn't and then it's all it's all good okay so let's and now we have four Pokemon in the party holy shit that's right <laughs> 